Haiti, cause damn it, I made it. Yes, I made it. What it do, D Dub Gang? It's your boy Dre, and today I'm back with another lit video, man. And look, bro, I know it's been a minute, but before we get into this video, make sure y'all go and like it up right now. Make sure y'all go and subscribe. Make sure y'all go and share this video. And look, make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. It's the Dre underscore Wait. But as y'all can tell by that title, man, it ain't about that beauty back there. No, it's about that beauty, but it's about this one, man. But before we get into it, y'all already know I got to show off the wide body, bro. I done took it out today already. Y'all was kind of out in the rain. That's why I made be a little dusty like it may be a little dirty right now but that thing is looking good let's just go and get a start up on it bro oh my gosh i really hold on hold on hold on let me just go and do this for you uh red brake calipers oh it's a little I'm like, it's, it's, it's a little quiet it's a little quiet but check this out man i'm thinking about probably on Thursday, tomorrow, I ordered my new camera, so make sure y'all stay tuned. It's a, uh, it's a camera I have a $2,000 camera, but I ordered my new camera. The quality is gonna get so much better on this channel, man. So look, if we only going up all 2020, I've been told y'all this, man. Like, I've been off the G7X for a minute now. If y'all was with me when I first made my channel, then y'all already know the quality was lit, the quality was good. But I'm thinking about it probably on Thursday. I'm gonna go go on and get the muffler delete. You know what I'm saying? I was gonna wait till my dog got his wire by the hair cat, but he he is out right now and he's ain't come he ain't come back to like another week or something like this. So he ain't gonna have his car for another week. So I'm thinking about just going to go get my muffler delete. I'm finna go on and make that thing sound good. And once I'm tired of muffler delete, guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go through a whole different exhaust. I don't know if I'm gonna do Corsa or if I'm gonna be oh what the fuck. I don't know if I'm gonna do Corsa or if I'm gonna do Boiler. So comment down below, give me y'all opinions, give me y'all, you know what I'm saying? Or if it's more exhaust that sound good, let me know. I just want it to sound like natural and just sound like muscle. I don't want it to sound like, like how these, I don't know, bro. They're like a lot of V6s be out here sounding like little Toyota cars or something that they don't fix up. They ain't I see it's some V8s, like, <sighs> to each his own, bro, but that ain't me. But look, man, let's go on and get into this thing, man. We got the 2020 CLS 53 AMG. I know what y'all thinking. That's a 2020. That's a 2020. That's a 19. What do you do? I do YouTube. <laughs> like a lot of people always ask me that, but I just made a video on that. But I don't think I briefly explained myself. If y'all want to know, I don't know. Just y'all got to find a way to get in touch with me, man. But anyways, I'm finna go on and pull this thing out. This thing is a little dirty right now herself. I'm finna go on and throw this away. You know what I'm saying? Don't nobody even ask for it because ain't nothing you could do with this right here. This is going in the garbage. They came off the wire body. But we finna go on and pull this thing out. Boom. And as y'all can see, bruh. Red drip in all my cars. Look at that. Look at that. Radio looking like a computer screen. But I'm gonna go on and crank this thing up. Let's hear it. It's a little quiet. It's a look, it's a little quiet, you know what I'm saying? But y'all see that AMG popping up. The colors go all the way through. Woo wee! Go all the way through. But let me go on and hold up. Let me put in sports plus. Y'all hear it got louder, right? I'm gonna give y'all a quick little reel. Wait till we get on the road and y'all hear that crack a pop. <sighs> niggas, niggas, niggas think this car, niggas think this car don't get down because it's a Mercedes. I'm telling you now, nah, it's a lot of Mercedes. Look, oh, she needs some gas. This is my lady car, by the way. I had bought it for, you know, but as y'all can see, I done put her in this garage and I'm over there in that garage because she barely moved her car so i'm like that's a tight squeeze so i'm gonna put your car for the twice what bro what is wrong with me today why did i just say twice i'm gonna put her car where the tight squeezes it and put mine's words you know what i'm saying wide enough you know what i'm saying well obviously because i got the wide body you know what i'm saying we don't do those slim bodies over here but anyways though let me go and get out and show y'all this thing man 
So as y'all can see, it kind of, it kind of, it kind of messed up the line up, don't it? You got all the black on blacks, but then you come with the gray. But it's hard though. It makes up for it. But as y'all can see, man, it's the CLS 53 AMG. Let's not forget, it's the big body. This ain't no, it's not a regular one. You dig what I'm saying? And my favorite part, I like the back view. I love that back view, man. That thing looks so good from the back, bro. I love it. And if the key is in your pocket, like it's in mine, you don't see it, but you can just swipe your pocket. Well, first you gotta unlock it. Mirrors come out, and then you swipe your pocket. Boom. <laughs> yeah. But anyways, man, if y'all ain't already, make sure y'all go subscribe to my main channel. It's Dre and Ken Empire of 1.5 million subscribers over there. Make sure y'all go show love. I got another family channel over uh, like 180,000 right now. So we on the road, we on the road, man. So if y'all want to know what I do, that's what I do. I, 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 I do YouTube. I get paid for sponsorships. I get paid for a lot of different things, man. But as y'all can see, look at the lights. Look at the headlights. Think about putting some RGB lights in there, but you know what? I'm thinking like just keep it straight Mercedes. But I think I'm gonna get the light up symbol because when I bought it, the guy was telling me that if you get the light up symbol, it may mess up a lot of the sensors that's in there because it, it's, it's, it's fully loaded. It got a lot of sensors on it. Those little things, they just not there for no reason. All those are sensors. So, but I'm thinking I'm, I'm gonna see, I'm gonna take it and see what another dealership say. And if they say I could do it, I'm gonna go and do it. Cause I was actually about to customize me another Mercedes AMG, but I'm like, you know what? Let me just slow down, man. And it was gonna let me put the little light up thing for the Mercedes with all the sensors and everything. So I'm like, maybe this guy didn't know what he was talking about. Cause he, the only thing he did was sold me the car. He didn't know nothing about the car. You feel what I'm saying? But anyways, show y'all a couple of these little things that it do. But as y'all can see right here, when you first come in, man, the AMG lights up. And yeah, this ain't a Maybach, but the damn show act like a Maybach. Look at that. And the curtain goes up. So whenever my fiance, which she's right there, and my son, they's walking down the street, man. But whenever they in here and it's hot back there, you just let the curtain up. You know what I'm saying? And if they ain't really hot enough, you know, you just let that motherfucker down. Just like that. Big and you got AMG engraved in the seats, but I love this red interior, man. This is the best part about the car. This is what really sold me right away. Like I didn't want to go look at no other car. This is the car she wanted, but I kind of wanted to look more. Look at him. He riding through slow looking. That's one thing about it. My house, is, I don't know. Like I guess they just like the cars or something, but it always pulls a lot of attention, man. But anyways, let me go and close that door like that. You got some nice. What that is? Pinnacle? Pinnacle? Did, did I say Pinnacle? But it got some nice speakers over here. You got the memory seats. And you got, I'm in Sports Plus right now. You got sports. You got regular sports. You got comfort. You got individual. And you also got slippery. But y'all know me. I like to go a little fast. So we're going to go Sports Plus. I'm going to go sports right now. But when we get on the road, we're going Sports Plus. And guys, also, also, this right here. This right here is the mouse. This is what controls everything up there. So if you want to hit the well, way, you can hit the home button, which is right there. You can hit the home button and you can control whatever you want to control. So you can also control your suspension. So let me just press that button. Well, actually, you can control it right here. So I think I showed this already, actually. So you can keep it in sports. Go Sports Plus and yeah, it's back in comfort. You can control your pipes. So if you want your pipes loud, all you got to do is press that. If you don't want it loud, you can turn it off. So it will it, it will show you right there. So when it focus, as y'all can see, powerful. So your pipes, you can press it, go powerful, press it again to turn it off. It'll go back to balance. So that's another thing that I love about this car. This is the auto thing. So when you stop and you're in comfort mode, the car will cut off. Then once you get ready to go at the light, when it turn green, it'll cut back on by itself. But if you, do, if you don't like that, all you got to do is press that button and that will go off. But it also, if you lay your phone right here, which I'm going to show y'all real quick if I got my phone. So here go my phone, right? If you lay it, watch it light up. That means it's charging. So that is a charger right there. I don't have to use that. Even though I can, I don't have to. I can just lay my phone down. You know what I'm saying? And this car also bag up for you and do all that different stuff. You know what I'm saying? I ain't really going to be doing letting the car bag up for me because I don't trust that. Y'all may trust that, but I don't trust that. And excuse me, man. I need a haircut, but that's besides the point right now. And we got the sunroof. Y'all already know how we do it. We got to let 
up the sunroof you did but yeah man before we get the road hit the road y'all can see it's lighting up two different colors it's lighting up red it's lighting up blue in there y'all see amg on the floor mats that's the difference between a lot of people you know if you got the amg if you see amg on any car you know oh they they're not spend some bread you know what i'm saying but anyways let me also show y'all this right here let me show y'all this you got the track pace we're not gonna go into that because we're not on a damn track right now so this is where you go to do the lights to change all the different lights what the fuck what was that saying you can go to a lot of different things but i know what y'all waiting for i ain't gonna talk y'all head off no longer we're gonna go on and take this thing for a spin right quick use bro like honestly ever since i got my wide body i don't even really be driving anything else this right here used to be my daily driver even though this is my girl car this used to be my daily driver this car also got a brand new transmission in it for the ones that don't know and it probably sound crazy considering the fact that it's a 2020 yeah i know right but it had metal shavings in the engine no it had metal shavings in the transmission and they had to you know it was it was it was some on mercedes in it wasn't none on my end my end so they had to take it back and then they put a whole new transmission there for free. So when y'all get these cars, man, make sure y'all get warranty. It's cool to look cool. Yeah, I got cash. Yeah, I'm gonna do this, but get your warranty. It ain't it ain't that much more a month. So just get the warranty. Let them pay for it. Don't you don't you don't you don't pay for it. You feel me? I'm gonna let y'all hear this thing. Here we go. Hey, y'all hear that crack of pop, man? Y'all heard that crack a pop. This thing get down. This thing get down. Comment down below if I should race this against my wide body charger. Comment down below what do y'all think. But let me go on and go around the curb like this. And as y'all can see, it got the sporty look on the steering wheel. Hold up right quick. It got the sporty look on the steering wheel. And it got AMG engraved on the steering wheel, man. But I love the steering wheel. I'm going to turn right here so I can go down here. And I'm gonna give y'all a good quick little pull right quick. So here we go. I ain't gonna show the speed. Woo-wee! I love this thing, man. I love it. I love it. N niggas may pull up beside me. Ah, uh, yeah, look at that cool cat. Yeah. And hey, that cool cat get down on your ass. Hold up. Let me let y'all hear the pipes. So this is what the crackle pop sound like in this car. Y'all heard that right? Let me go and do a quick U-turn so y'all can really hear it. So y'all can really hear what I'm talking about. I ain't gonna do no burnouts and nothing like that, you know, cause here we go. Y'all heard that right? Come on now. This ain't to be fucked with. Ain't nothing in my yard regular. Best believe everything got some speed. You know what I'm saying? Even that Jeep. You might think that Rubicon ain't got no speed. Oh, okay. Get beside it. Why am I already up there? It also have the speed in the window. I'm gonna make that pop up and show y'all. Let me go on and get y'all a quick little pull. Listen. Yeah. Yeah. And now nah, I don't got no modified exhaust. I don't got none of that. It came like that. I should have been did a video on this car because I know a lot of y'all probably been sleep on it. Y'all probably looking at it. Oh, they just a little Mercedes in over there. It was just a little Mercedes. But guess what? The Mercedes got speed. The Mercedes, it got class also. Look at that vet. It's a nice little vet right there. Y'all see it? Y'all probably can't see it, but it was great with the black wheels. I always like Corvettes. I was gonna go buy the C8, but I'm like, you know what? I don't want it no more. Too many people got it. I don't I don't like something that a lot of people got. You feel what I'm saying? That's why that's why I stepped out the way when I got the wide body. It's a lot of people that's getting the wide bodies now, you feel what I'm saying? But that's cool. But I just don't like that's just me personally. I don't like having something that a lot of people got. But when I got it at the time, then nobody really have it. But they go to police, so let me put the camera down. Uh, shh, know how they get. We in the rich neighborhood. He might think, swear up and down, I got a gun. Come on now. Yeah. Yeah. And another thing, man, you can also change how this looks. As y'all can see, it look like that. I like it looking like that because it look like futuristic, right? So you can also, you can give it a sporty look. Let's give it a sporty look. 
that's what it looked like when you give it a sporty look. You know, that's one thing I like about the digital. You know what I'm saying? I love it digital because you don't have to just settle with one thing. You can change a lot of different things. So let's go to classic. This is what classic look like. And as y'all can see, it give you the speed limit, AMG, you know. I actually, this one probably looks better. This one probably looks better, but let's go back to progressive. Now this is the one that I like because it just, it just gave it like a futuristic look. But we probably go back and change it to classic because classic actually look good, man. I cannot count. And this car also, yeah, as y'all can see the charge, yeah. You got your, you also got your parking brake down here. You also got your lane switch. So if you get out the lane and then, you know what I'm saying, you probably, I don't know, falling asleep or whatever the case may be, it'll throw you back in the lane. And it's a lot of uh, parking. So when you bagging up or you're getting too close to something, like I showed y'all, so watch this. I'm finna get real close when I get to this handicap thing and y'all will see that as you get too close, it's gonna beep. It's gonna show you, it, it pops up yellow, it let you know, hey, you're getting close. More yellow, orange, it get close. So I'm not gonna get in the red because that'll be a little too close and we ain't got time for that. And you can also expand your camera to a wider angle, you know what I'm saying? Which is pretty dope. I find that right there pretty dope. Also, I forgot to show y'all the brake calipers. Y'all can see, they say AMG as well. But how about this? When I get back home, probably today if it don't rain, I'm gonna wash this car up because this car need a wash. I understand they've been putting a lot of energy into my wide body. But it's time that I go back into putting a lot of energy into all my cars, man. Because I just gotta make sure everything stay good with the cars. You gotta make sure you crank it up, drive it. Because these cars haven't really been getting driven that much. The Rubicon and the AMG, it haven't really been getting driven that much and that's what i gotta start back doing bro i gotta start back doing but i left my wallet at home so i'm gonna go back i'm gonna go get my wallet i'm gonna get some gas but i'm gonna let y'all hear a little bit of the pipes right now never gets old if i like if dodge would have red that looked like this i would have got my red this leather but i got alcantara because dodge over here is like lighter but then the seats is like this color or darker like i feel like that is so ugly and i'm just not gonna have just any type of leather you're not just gonna put me in any type of leather like so dodge make sure y'all look fix that man fix that like y'all could do better bro but anyways though let me go on and hop back up in this thing. Close the door just like that. And another fun fact, gang. I can crank up all my cars from my phone except the Jeep. So this one and my wide body, I can crank it up from my phone. I can lock. I can do a lot of things. It's more that I can do with this. I can also put, do valet mode from my phone. I can cut it off wherever it's at. I can track it. I can do all of that. It's a lot of things that I can do that you probably wouldn't even expect it be able to do. So I can't do a review without popping the hood so let me pop the hood bro so first up guys i look don't even don't even don't even roast me for this i actually never popped the hood to this car so i'm just looking this the trunk right here right this a trunk that's the parking brake they usually where it be on most cars and i'm just trying to see where do i pop the hood like bro hold up right quick i know i ain't tripping i know i ain't tripping that's the trunk where do I pop the hood? It's a little latch. What's that red latch? What does it say? Let me see what it say first. Oh, that's the hood. Let's go. We in there. That's crazy. That's crazy. Niggas, and look, y'all see the sparkles in the paint. Niggas get a little money, don't even pop the hood. Back when I had my Honda Civic, I popping the hood every five seconds. I like that. That look well put together. Y'all may think I'm lying, but I never looked under this hood. So as y'all can see, it got AMG right there. You know what I'm saying? Let me go on and close that back down. With these cars, they be having to do software updates like iPhones. So I think it's in Germany, you know, cause I was talking to the Mercedes owner or whatever. Yeah, the owner is crazy, right? I was talking to him and then he said he had to get some info from Germany or something like that. So he did a software update on this car and everything just been working great, man. So would I buy another Mercedes? Yes, probably so. The one I would probably buy it's the 4x4 G-Wagon, man. I love it. But, bro, it's hot as fuck in Texas, bro. Let's just take a second to acknowledge that. I'm in here sweating. 
But look at that, bro. 94 degrees. I guarantee you my phone say it feel like 169. All right, guys, I'm back up in here. Let's get in it. Before this thing get down and dirty, I got money. I got money. Any YouTuber y'all know, you know what I'm saying? That's probably in the Houston area, of course. Any YouTuber y'all know, they got a Mercedes or whatever. Tell them to race Dre. Race me. Race me and we can race for the bread. I'm telling you, you don't want to do it. You don't want to mess up your engine trying to keep up with me. You cannot do it. Let me go and let this truck go. Go on, go, nigga. Don't do all that weird shit. All right, here we go. Let's get in it. Shit, I thought that was a police jet then. Y'all probably didn't see me hitting brakes. But hell no, nah, man. I'm over here in Mexico, so y'all know. I don't know, man. I just had to, you know, chill out for a minute. I don't want my civilians to think I'm crazy over here. What I'm finna do right now is I'm finna give y'all a quick zero to 60. We are about to see how this thing get down, man. So let me go up a little bit. Y'all can see I don't want nobody tripping over here. So let me go up a little bit. Slow down, slow down. And as y'all can see, we finna see how quick it can go zero to 60. One, two, three, go. Let me know in the comments right now. I wasn't doing the time. I think it got something on here that you can do the time. I know my wife about to do, so I know this should be able to do that. So let me know. And also, these are the paddle shifters. This is what I was also doing. So as I get up here, I'm gonna let y'all listen to it shift down. And every time it shift down, it crack or pops. But yeah, guys, and also right now I'm finna get gas. Then I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna show y'all me playing with the paddle shift. Another thing I want to tell y'all, a new video is probably coming right after this. Probably not on the same day, but the next day, a new video will be coming, and it will most likely be me going to look for a truck. Which truck I'm gonna buy? And um, hopefully I don't walk away with buying something that's not my intentions. I'm not trying to go buy soon as i get there you know so i plan on just searching around looking for the truck i want i got a few trucks in mind that like i really love that i will really want you know one of them one of them i'm gonna let y'all know i'm gonna let y'all know the brand it's a ford but it's over a hundred thousand dollars it's over a hundred thousand dollars just let just 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 let me tell y'all this this thing is so hard. I don't think any of y'all probably got it on your mind. I don't think any of y'all probably seen it. I haven't really seen it on YouTube at all, but I seen like a review of it, of course, but that thing badass, man. So if I pull that off, hey, we about to go crazy, but I don't want to jump straight to that. I want to search around. I want to look which truck may be the best. So if y'all have some trucks in mind, Make sure y'all please comment them down below. That'll greatly be appreciated, you know? Like, some of y'all may got some good ideas. They may be the one I get, all because of you. So, just let me know, man. Shout out to those guys right there, man. I don't know who they work for, but shout out to them. Hold up, let me press two so I can let my seat back, man. As y'all can see, it's just a steering wheel and it'll adjust the seat. But shout out to those guys, man. I ain't know what bro was doing, though, because when, when he was walking by, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm already like, hold up, I done... I done fucked up, you know. I had left my keys sitting right here on the passenger side. So I'm like, I don't know what he doing. He just keep looking. He probably just think he look good, though. Like, that was a rookie mistake. That's something that I don't normally do at all. But he was just walking by. He was like, yee. Whoa. Yee. I'm like, man, I don't know what wrong, dude. Man, I don't, I don't want to have to hurt this nigga today. Then yee. I'm like, what the hell wrong with you, man? But anyways, he had just said, oh, this the beast right here, huh? This thing badass. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he was like, it's an AMG. How fast do it go? I was like, it got 180 on the dash, as y'all can see. It got 180 on the dash, but it only do like 170. So they just went on and kept talking about it. Then they were like, oh, yeah, this thing badass, man. Then I was like, yeah, I don't even. This ain't like crazy thing. This is not even my favorite one that's in my yard. Like the favorite one is the wide body. You know what I'm saying? I love my wide body. He was like, oh, yeah, this 2020, huh? I was like, yeah. In my head, I'm thinking like, yeah. Both of them 2020. Anyways, though, shout out to those guys, man. They love this thing. Then he was talking about the red interior. You know, like, I just get a lot of love everywhere I go and all my cars. And guess what? Ain't neither one of them. Not one of them. 
customized yet. That's the crazy part about it. That's the crazy part about it. But I don't want to keep rubbing that in y'all face because I know I ain't did it yet. And I know y'all probably get mad at me. But I got to do it on my time because guess what? I just want to tell Atlanta, drop the big bag. I'm talking about a big bag. Hey, that black on black, I ain't look good. But for some reason, bro, I want too much like ice. But let me go on and sit this thing up right quick. And I'm going to play with the paddle shifters. I love that thing. And all y'all gotta do is hold the paddle shifter if you wanna go back to manual mode. Look at this challenger, man. He don't want no smoke. You don't, ah, oh, that's a lady. That's a lady. I don't give a fuck. Punch it on YouTube. Y'all hear them cracker pops? Listen. Woo! That never gets old, bruh. But anyways, I'm finna head back to the crib. And I'm gonna catch y'all when I get there. All right, gang, powder shift time. Let's get it. Woo! I love this car, man. And y'all see this, right? It stops on the dime. Red light. It stopped on the dime. Y'all see how I had to stop on the dime? Boy, I love this car. So if any of y'all wondering why, I bought this car. This is why I bought it. I didn't buy it just because of a price, just because it's it costs a lot of money. It's a lot of things that I love, like this. Come on, man. Come on, man. That thing pop every time I shift the gear. What the powder shifter that is, but Come on, man. I love this car, bro. I wouldn't trade it for nothing. Like, if I had something to trade it to, I like the I like the um, new 2020 AMG GTs, but if you ask me, they both the same. I think that one right there probably got a little bit more power, of course, and I like the seats that come with it also. It, it got like a real racing, sporty looking seats. Like, I find that very dope, but this right here, I just bought this for my girl because I she always wanted a she always wanted a Mercedes. Not only she wanted a Mercedes, she always wanted an AMG. So I made that happen. You know what I'm saying? And we both love red and all our cars. Even though on my wide body, I was about to get them to put orange seats in my wide body. Y'all ain't never seen nobody put orange seats in a wide body. Well, in probably a charger period with them just customizing at the dealership. But I had a plug at the dealership. They was gonna do it for me, but I ended up not doing it because I'm like, you know what? If I want it did, I just get it did later. So I went on and got the red calipers. I went and got the red uh, interior. You know what I'm saying? So my life is just a blessing, bro. And like, this just me having fun with this thing. This is me having fun with one of my toys. You know, just one of one of one of a lot that's yet to come. You know, it's a lot of cars I want. It's a lot of cars that I'm gonna get. But it's also a time and place for everything. You know, I'm not. I'm not in a rush to, you know what I'm saying, keep on buying all this, buying all that. But I am going to get a truck very, very soon. I am going to um, probably go back out, buy me another sports car. But my next car, or my second next car, probably be an exotic, which is a Lamborghini Aventador. Y'all know um, that I always been my dream car. I'm sure it's been a lot of y'all dream car. And like, I mean, who wouldn't want a Lamborghini Aventador? So... That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go cop that. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna, I'm gonna shake the streets with that shit, man. I ain't even lying though. But anyways, I'm pulling back up to the crib. And another thing I wanna let y'all know, man. Say for instance, like me, I'm a public figure. I'm a motivation to millions around the world. Millions of people that watch me, I'm a motivation to. But you wanna, you wanna know what means just as much to me, if not the most, that I'm a motivation to the streets back where I'm from. You feel what I'm saying? Cause I'm, like I always say, like y'all always hear me say, I'm from a small town. We don't have, we don't, we don't even have a grocery store where I'm from. You gotta, you gotta go way out your way to even go to a grocery store to go get a pack of meat. You feel me? We don't got no McDonald's. We don't got none of that. All we got is a Family Dollar and a dollar store and um, two gas stations. Two gas stations. That's where, that's where most people eat their meals from almost every day. If they ain't going out the way to go to the uh, grocery store, they going to the gas stations. But Anyways, I'm just here to let y'all know, bro. Anything you want to do in life, you can do it. I'm a, I'm a living testimony. I'm a living witness. Like, all this shit didn't come easy. I was literally in college two years ago. 
I dropped out. I dropped out of college. Yeah, I dropped out of college. A lot of people call me stupid. A lot of people call me dumb. But what y'all fail to understand, I know what I want in life. College is not for everybody. Just because I got on this. Just because I got on a nice cardio bracelet. Just because I got earrings in my ear. Like, y'all probably look at me as a walking bag. I look at myself as a walking testimony that, like, y'all can get out here, y'all can live this shit, too. I ain't out here living no gangster life. I ain't out here selling drugs, doing all that. I seen a lot of people come in debt. Well, a few people. I ain't gonna say a lot. I seen a few people that think I sell drugs. They like, you only got 20K subscribers on your channel, and you got a big-ass house. You got three cars. So, how do you afford it? It's definitely not from a YouTube channel. First time, my brother, I don't sell drugs. I never sold drugs. Have that ever came up in my mind to go and sell drugs? Yes, it have. I'm not going to lie. Because there was times where I was almost seeing, like, my grandmother down. You know, because that's who I stayed with. That's who basically raised me a lot in my life. My great-grandmother. I was, she wasn't down. But you always know, like, you can kind of tell when it's a problem. But they don't want to let you know because you're a child and there's nothing you can do. So that always up in my mind. Well, it was back then, it was up in my mind because I wanted more money. I wanted more for my family. And that's what I'm doing right now. Right now, what I'm doing... What this what I want to let y'all know the money I spend I don't spend no more than probably 10% or 15% of the money I make each month I don't spend no more than that the only time I really spent a lot was Like lately when I just want to close on my condo, you know what I'm saying cuz obviously I stay in Texas now I got a house out here. I want to close on my condo. So I have to go drop a huge bag you feel what I'm saying? I had to drop a huge bag. So what I do is, this is what I want y'all to do. You know, I don't live check to check. Because, like, I know it's a lot of people that do. Keep going. Keep uh, striving. Keep pushing. But I don't live check to check. But this is how I do live. Do I save money? Yes, I save money. But one thing you don't do, this is one thing I live by and I want y'all to live by. Don't touch your savings. You feel me? Don't touch your savings. I don't care if you got zero dollars in your checking and you got a million dollars in your saving. If you can go out, if you can go how many ever days until you get paid or whatever the case may be or in my case until i get another sponsorship or until i get paid from youtube y'all can see that go my family right here come on yeah here come on bad boy i'm telling them some real stuff right quick so this way i just i need to get this out before it slipped my mind so if you can go without you know what i'm saying touching your money and your chicken don't touch it until you get another paper i don't care if you got a million in your savings don't touch what's in your chicken if you, I mean, don't touch what's in your savings, no matter if you run out what's in your chicken. Babe, this is what I'm telling them. I'm telling them about, like, about, like, money tips. We just, we just, we just, we just spent a lot of money, you know, over the past weekend and stuff. So, what I'm telling them is, is just giving them game. And this is what I soak up for myself as well. Not just telling them, but what I choose to live by. But, you know how we just spent a lot of money and we always say, don't touch what's in savings. Mm -hmm. What I'm telling them is, no matter if you got a million dollars in savings, if you run out of what's in your checking, if you can live without touching what's in your savings, then do that, right? You don't have to go touch what's in your savings, right? Mm -hmm. And that's something that 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 I also, I'm not perfect at, at all. Uh, I have to get better at, but that's what I'm telling y'all to do. So don't do that. But me, I have several different ways of getting paid, which is sponsorships. I'm a pimp. Promotion. YouTube promotions. I pimp from time to time. <laughs> we lying, man. We lying. But anyways, though, yeah, man. That's just what I want to tell y'all. And uh, yeah, this is basically the Mercedes AMG. If you how you gonna do a review on my car, but they didn't even show me driving my own car, bro. Cuz who wants to see you driving? You ain't gonna drive it the way it's supposed me. to be driven. Yes, I do. You don't even touch the paddle shifters. You, you don't, don't even. You barely know how to use a paddle shifter. Hey, honestly. Honestly, what I should have had, I wish I had my thing to set the camera up like I told them, my little camera mount, but I didn't have that because it would have been a lot better, you know, but I really didn't need that. Y'all probably enjoyed it anyway, but yeah, man, it's the AMG. Get out and record it right quick for me, baby. Flip that camera down so y'all can see the neighbors. Turn your signal light off. <laughs> I need to drive to the bank, so maybe we can go to the bank. You gotta put a case and car seat in you here, though. In the bank? No. Oh, okay. 
Alright, so, alright guys, we're gonna go on the end of this video off right here. Comment down below if y'all want more reviews. Me, I like to do reviews on my own cars, you know, even though I only have three, but I love them as y'all can see. This right here do a lot of shit. It do more than I don't even think I told y'all about. I'm sure once the camera cut off, I'll probably think of more stuff, but make sure y'all like it up, subscribe right now, share the video, y'all can see this dude. Just... Did you show them my lights? That's my favorite part. Oh yeah, the lights in the car. You know what? Make sure y'all stay tuned. Well, I probably already showed y'all that, but I'm gonna wait till the night, and I'm probably gonna insert a clip of the lights changing at nighttime. So, yeah, make sure y'all stay tuned, man. But until next time, I'm out. Peace.